he's he's very funny. He's he's a very quirky kind of dog. A giant baby. Yeah. He still acts like a baby. Yeah, he's pretty much a gigantic puppy. We we explicitly went to the big dog foster session with the idea of fostering a big dog, and then going around the um the shelter that day saw the biggest one, which is this dude. Likes balls. If it if it's shaped like a ball, he'll he'll chase it. And even if it's at the point where it can't be squeezed, he'll still try to squeeze it. Um, because he knows it's a ball and it's one of his favorite things. Please. I don't know if you can tell it, but he's leaning all his weight on me right now. That's good. Look at it. Yeah, I think I think whoever, you know, whatever family he goes to next, um, I think it takes a lot of consistency in um in walking him and get, having a really good routine. He he has done better over time, I think, because he trusts us more to make sure that he's okay. So um he likes like belly rubs and attention and stuff. He also likes his space too. He's a very derpy uh kind of mm -hmm. awkward kind of an awkward dog um so he'll bump into as many things as he can yeah yeah you know. and he won't he won't, he won't mind he will just keep going yeah i think he walked into what was it you were walking he's, him he was looking backward yeah. but walking forward so he, he walked into three different poles in a row <laughs> oh my <laughs> god and he didn't mind he just kept going after that he was focused. He was, yeah. he was very focused, but he knew which way to walk. He just didn't think that there would be something in front of him. Yeah. What a derpy boy. I love it.